Nobody wants to be a sheep. We want to stand out in a crowd. We want to be unique, but we don't want to pay thousands and thousands of pounds for customized products. The age of mass customization is here. Realistically priced products, but that make you stand out, that give you that edge of being unique and also being part of the design process. So I want to show you something today. Um, I've been given a code uh, by Motorola to try out their new Moto Maker um, process where you basically get to uh, choose and design elements of your Android handset. Let me just jump into the page here and show you. So this is what the web page looks like when you first open it up. You go to motorola.co.uk slash motomaker or motorola.com slash motomaker depending on where you are. Now, um, let me read out what the blurb says about this process before we start off. Um, design your very own tailor-made smartphone using Motomaker, Motorola's online design studio. Select your own authentic materials, including leather or bamboo. Choose from thousands of colour options and styles, and even write a custom phrase to the back of your Moto X to give it an extra personal touch. Um, you can also choose to have it preloaded with all of your contacts so that it can arrive ready to send all the festive messages to or greetings to. A Moto Maker is currently available for the Moto X, um, which has a vivid 5.2 5 inch full HD display, uh, voice controls and works with the latest version of Android. Its super speedy quad core processor delivers seamless multitasking so you can enjoy um, the web, apps, video and more. Perfect for keeping you entertained over uh, whatever you happen to be doing. Now, the uh, the price range here it starts um, at around four hundred pounds um, for the basic uh, customized version plus add-ons. So um, bear that in mind when you're going through this process. So let's go through the process um, and um, and see. Now you'll see there the the value is naught. That's because I've been given a code very kindly by Motorola to try this process out for you. Um, so full disclosure there. They will be sending me the phone um, and I will be trying it out. Um, so first of all. Our first choice is, I've literally not fired up this yet, so this is all completely new to me. Um, so it's a, a learning experience together. Um, so first of all, back colour. We have a number of choices. There's wood, um, leather, cool, neutral or warm colours. So do we want wood or do we want leather? There are five leather choices. Let's have a look what leather choices there are. So there's a, a natural colour, a red leather, a black leather, a cognac leather, or a navy blue. Um, oh, do you know what? I'm kind of intrigued to know what the, the wood effects are like. Are they really wood? See, these might be quite cool. Um, the cool colours, lightly tinted hues with a soft scratch res resistant finish. Um, neutral, uh, neutral tones with a scratch resistant finish. finish. And then there's some warm matte colour with a scratch resistant finish. Do you know what? I am tempted to go with a pink. Oh, and as you click on it, look, it, tells, it shows you what it's going to look like up the top there. See, this is kind of cool. It's retro look, isn't it? There's a honey coloured wood there. And the teak finish. See, I quite like the walnut finish. I think I might go with a walnut finish. Um, okay, well we can come back and change that, so we can we can sort of see how that fits um, and see how that set, settles with us. Um, okay, choose your favourite colours for uh, the front. So either black or white, basically. So we go for a black surround or we go for a white surround. I'm thinking the black, actually. I'm thinking the black. Uh, the trim. Now this might make me change my um my my choice in terms of the uh, of the rest of it because look how that sits together now so i can see uh, if i go for black with a purple trim with red maybe how's that going to fit with the do you know what? i kind of like the yellow <laughs> metallic gold that might be an old metallic orange so these are all metallics right so we've got orange, violet, green, olive, lemon, lime, 
bronze. Oh, bronze might go nicely with the wood. Mmm. Yeah, look at that. Bronze, I think. Thinking bronze. What would you go for? It's difficult, isn't it? Sometimes too many choices can be can be a bad thing. But let's go with the bronze for now, because that kind of fits quite nicely with the um but you see, given that, then maybe we'll look at maybe we'll have a look at some of the other colours. Cases. Okay, coming soon. That's not there's not an available option on that. So do we want to go for 16 or 32 meg uh, gig? Well they've given me uh So that 32 gig is what they've given me in this code and then uh, engraved message for the back oh my god what are we gonna say what are we gonna put on there um, so okay so I've obviously picked something that is over the balance that they've given me let's have a look it's not that So there's a twenty pound purchase price there. Maybe it's the engravement engraving. Let's have a look though. Let's have a look at some different designs. So we go for a red leather. And then if we go for the trim, let's have a look what the what the trim's gonna look like. Go for red leather with Red metallic. Or maybe if we go for, let's have a look at one of these. Raspberry. <laughs> I like pink stuff. So sue me. Um, I know that, you know, there's a lot, a lot of um, gender discrimination or gender bias kind of movements that uh, have issue with that. But I like pink. <laughs> Get over it. Um, so if I went with the pink and yellow, mm, orange, maybe violet. Mm. How about violet and violet? Let's see. This is great that you can actually just uh, now, I'm, I'm definitely going to go with the black, I think. But you can just kind of like flip backwards and forwards and say, how's that going to look with that? How's that going to look with that? Metallic gold. It's going to be a bit bling, isn't it? Oh, quite like the bling though. Interesting. Interesting. Ah, was that back? The wooden back. Yes, that's the. So basically, there's the standards, and I guess if I went for a leather one, right. So this is how much the extras will cost plus twenty. Um, so basically, uh, they've given me a code very kindly to try this out and show you how it works um, that gives me the basics um, at no cost. So if I want to upgrade some of them, th them to other things, um, then, um, then that's going to uh, have a, an impact, a little bit of impact on the cost. <laughs> Who am I to complain, right? Um, but I'm thinking, actually, kind of fancy going for something quite... Oh, spice. Uh, no, do you know what? I like the pink. I like the violet. And if I go for violet with the black front and the... Do I go for a violet silver trim? Yeah, I might do, you know. Gold looks pretty nice, but okay I'm pretty happy with that um, let's move on then um, now engraving this is probably going to be extra as well um, but you know what I love there's a phrase that I love which I've had stuck up here on my wall um, which I think is really I'm going to show you um, I love this um, I can't remember where it's from um, I'll find out um, not all those who wander are lost um, and I think that that is the perfect phrase for the back of a uh, mobile smartphone not all those who 
wander are lost. Oh, I could only have 14 characters. Boo. <laughs> okay. So, what do we want to say that's 14 characters long? Hmm. Well, I'm known... as Kate Click. That's a bit un unimaginative though, isn't it? What can we say that's 14 characters long? Looking around my room for inspiration. You may do the same. Um... Well, that's the title of my, oh, it's too many, too many characters. Well, that's the title. That's the title of my uh, novel, my science fiction novel. How will that look? Nah. I don't think that's it. No, it needs to be something more imaginative than that. Let's go for... Do you know what? There's a great, um, there's a really good um, uh, saying, uh, phrase, uh, quote. Do you know what? There's a really good quote um, from Larry Page of Google, um, as this is an Android phone, seems somewhat appropriate. Um, Almost every time we do something crazy, we make progress. So. How about I send myself a little reminder? No. Go crazy. How about I send myself a little reminder? Go crazy. I reckon that will do. A little remember reminder to do something crazy uh, and uh, hopefully make progress. More options. Mah, greeting. On your phone startup screen, you can display a name, write a personalised message, or leave it blank. 18 characters. So, what would that be then? If it's if it's my phone, Kate Russell. Oh, how about, good morning, Kate. Ha! <laughs> yes, that will work. Wallpaper. <gasps> look, 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 look. So, there's a bunch of wallpapers here that I could choose have it started up and you can always change your wallpaper later on right but it's nice if you if you don't if you're not kind of that um, uh, sort of uh, familiar with technology um, and you know maybe this is your first smartphone um, oh that might be nice because that kind of fits in with my not all those who wander are lost right um, but Kind of like that. I kind of, actually, I kind of like that one best. Yeah, I think I like that one best. Um, yes, yeah, so it's, it's kind of nice that you can go through all of this. It doesn't cost any. It's part of the standard because you can see my price hasn't gone up at all. So it's part of the standard offering, um, and you can have it um, set up with stuff that um, that you want. Uh, wall charger. 
white. Okay. A white charger is included with your device and that's it. There is no other options for that. Okay. So that is that. So now you would click on the buy button and let's just double check that we're completely happy with what we've got. So we've gone for the uh, violet back, the black foot front with the violet trim to go in with the, with the back. Very nice. Um, we've got it engraved with a reminder to go crazy and uh, it's going to come preloaded with a greeting that says good morning Kate when I fire it up and uh, uh, the uh, jellyfish wallpaper. Okay and so then we click on buy and we add to cart and at this point obviously uh, your price uh, would um, add to the cart um, which would be whatever it is that you've chosen and there is the order um, now we uh, check out so you're, obviously your price would, would be in there um, you have a, an option to buy some extra bits and pieces um, non-glare film uh, moto hint by Motorola, there's some shock absorbing film, brilliant screen film, so there's a few little extras that you can add um, along the way as well and then you check out and um, a few uh, weeks later, I'm going to log in with Google, um, kind of makes sense doesn't it? It's my Google account, nice and quick, it's already got my profile details um, and then I guess it's going to send me through to a page now to put in uh, the delivery information. And there we are. My shiny new Motorola ready to press order by clicking the order button. I agree to Motorola's terms and conditions. Press this order. And that's it. That's my order summary. Uh, order references there, estimated delivery date 26th of May 2015, it's the 17th of May today so I have about um, uh, uh, 10 days, 9 days to wait uh, for the delivery. Um, so brilliant, I will uh, make sure that I check in with you when that comes, um, it was an incredibly easy process, um, I'll make sure that I check in with you and um, show you the finished article. So I hope that's been useful to you and um, I look forward to sharing with you more news as the phone arrives.